All right, guys. I it is your boy King Jamba here at uh, yeah. Enchantment Alley. Alley in Urbana, Illinois, and I am here with Nick. Uh, Nick uh, was a player at the locals today. Uh, Nick, how did you do? I did okay. Went two and two. Uh, what were you playing? I was pay playing uh, Paleo, Paleo Frog. All right. Uh, any shout outs? Nah, not really. I'm kind of just getting back to the game, so it's the first time I've done too well in tournaments. So All right. All true. right. Well, let's get into it. All right. Um, free swap, that is, like, mandatory. Um, if someone doesn't play three swap, they're wrong. And kind of similarly, <laughs> three dupe, like, you can't, you can't not play three of each of these. Um, Ronin Totem, though, I only play two. Um, I don't think you need more than two. It recurs itself really well. I've never had an issue. Um, so pretty much just the mandatory paleo. Yeah, card. I mean, if this is like really standard, if you yeah. don't play that, I mean, I don't know, it'd be surprising. So, <laughs> um, this is kind of different though. I play Lilith. So, um, why Lilith? So, the problem I was having is like, if like on the rare occasion that I do get a lot of like monsters in hand, um, I can't, I don't feel like I can set enough fast enough. Um, and it is really nice to be able to just play them down immediately. Uh, it's also a body, which can sometimes be nice if you're being a little cheesy and you can't get the rest of your combo off. <laughs> so it worked okay. Um, Spice. <laughs> yeah, it, it never came in clutch or anything today, but it was a card that like did what it was supposed to. So uh, then kind of stand just the Ash. Uh, besides Imperm, that's the only hand trap I play. It did exactly what it was supposed you to. You hit me twice. Yeah, it, it found the top of my hand, uh, top of my deck like every time I needed it. <laughs> um, this, so scapegoat. Um, mm. Konami, please put this at three. Um, <laughs> Never. I, I need it. This is one card, Avermax. This is. Oh this, yeah. I mean, it's ridiculous. Um, <laughs> I I drew this card and it was always great unless it got negated. Konami, put it at three. Get out of Seriously. here. Seriously. <laughs> um, with the Canadian, mm. um, Book of Mood is really strong. Um, still, and that's really all this card is. Mm -hmm. So I was really happy with that. Konami put it at three. There yeah. You go. Seriously, wow. I wish that was scapegoat, but. Um, Olenoid is kind of for a similar reason, like MST was a good card for a long time for a reason, and it's it's just easy. I mean, hey, I, I'm a uh, cyborg to MST. Yeah, I mean, it's it's good, like, in the fact, like, the fact that it's a paleo just makes it better. <laughs> um, so this is kind of different, so I play, um, Tumorella. Oh, really? Um, so people don't play this. I like it because, it, for, for, well, the reason I play it really is because I, did, I didn't like Feed on Amiscus. Um, Three so two Dynamiscus. Dynamiscus. Yeah. Um, I wanted to put something in place of that, and I felt like Morella did a good job of just deck, deck thinning. You play Morella, path, uh, ditch Morella, then you have two Paleos in Grave. It's a little bit easier to start plays. So I liked it, and Dynamiscus just kind of felt a little cloggy. There are a lot of times where you want to set most of your hand, and you don't want to have cards to discard. So that's kind of why that happened. Interesting. Um, I played two Heavy Storm Duster. It's the other card I took out for Morella. Mm -hmm. I don't like that. I think I want to put it back to three um, because it, it, I needed, like, there was a time where I trap tricked it and I, I needed to be able to play that one. So mm. I, I wish I had another. Two is still good because you can trap trick it still. Yeah. Um, but wish I had another one. So I might change some stuff for that. Yeah. Um, three Crackdown. This card is amazing. Um, I was saved so many times with this card. Just being able to take anything essentially has been dope. <laughs> Um, Imperm, that's Imperm. I mean, yeah. It's a card. Can we throw them away? Uh, yeah. <laughs> right. If you want to pay me for it. Uh, yeah, no. Imperm, Imperm was great because, like, like for one thing, being able to trap trick it is amazing. So, I love that. Speaking of which, trap trick. Trap trick. Card. Um, <laughs> this card is great. It's just an extra copy of any trap in the deck, which is why you always run at least two it's, if you can. It's nuts. Uh, two traps, I mean. Yeah. yeah it's a good card. Uh, Compulse is... Stupid, dude. I, was, I saw okay. I saw this card all day. Yeah, get rid of this card. It is <laughs> compulsive three is ridiculous. It's it. There's like a lot of time. There's like okay, compulse great. Goes back to him. It, it's amazing. I'm I'm really surprised more people don't run it. I mean, it, I just wish I could see it more. So, um, well, I saw and, well, I saw it all day today. Yeah. So, <laughs> <laughs> and that's what might be where I got it from. Is this locals? Um, and then a pre order. Mm. Um. It's good. I don't Ooh, think it's... Am, am it nice looking one. Yeah. Um, I don't know if it's mandatory. I mean, I like it a lot um, because there's not a lot of, like, there's a lot of decks that, like, they'll play a spell. It's nice to just be able to have it. Or, like, Necro Valley, which came up a lot today. Yeah. It's nice to have it. Um, but other than that, I don't know. It might go to side. So. All right. 
What's next? Yeah, we'll do extra next. All right. Um, Three Toad. Mandatory. Yeah, this is the reason the deck works. <laughs> Uh, without this, without this card, you just don't play the deck. Like it, it's not good without it. So <laughs> you need it. Um, this is a card I don't like. Um, but you play it. Why? Yeah. Well, part of the reason I play it is that I, I kind of felt like I needed to. Um, it never came up. It, I've never had it come up where I really felt like I needed it. Um, it's a lot of people play. A lot, a lot of people play this, and then they play the other one that gets played a lot. I can't remember the name of. But I don't know. It just like it never did anything for me. I, I could see situations where it could, so I'm keeping it because I don't have anything to replace it with anyway. But I don't know. Um, Link Spider and Link Karibo. These are basically just for the scapegoat play. Oh um, uh, yeah. They're crucial for that. And again, you don't run a lot of links anyway, so you might as well. Um, Akashic Magician is okay. Um, mm. Okay, so explain to me what this card does, because I've seen it on multiple Paleozoic uh, deck lists lately. Honestly, and... for me today, it didn't do anything, which really? kind of sucks. Um, I, you see a lot of deck lists that run it and like you know, have rave reviews. I never, I mean, I just didn't feel like it was ever necessary. It, it basically, it bounces. Um, it, you have other ways to do that if you need to, and there's other things I'd rather have out most of the time. So, I don't know, it, it was never something I just loved. So, All right. um, which actually speaking of which is the star boy, um, mm. some people run two. I don't think gaining 500 is super good. Um, it, I mean, it can be in certain situations, but like, I don't think it warrants a second one over like something that could be good with Kashik. Um, I don't know. I'm keeping it one for now. I think it's okay. So one uh, the star. Yeah. Yeah. Cause some people run it at two and three. Yeah. I ran it at two for a while. So um, is it booty? It just, I don't feel, at least with wh what I've been running into, I don't have a lot of, like, I don't use links for more than to get to the big boys. Um, so, I mean, they can be obviously very useful kind of intermittently if you can only get up to a certain stage. Um, but, like, the 500, it never came up. Really, it really never does, even when I had to. So, um, Phoenix is good. Yeah, It's basically a staple. Um, Security Dragon actually was really good today because um, co-linking it with um, Spider or Link Karibo is just easy. And you do that every time you use Scapegoat. So it was nice to be so able to how, use So how often did Security Dragon come up? At least two or three games. Every time every time Scapegoat came out, it came out. Okay. Um, for sure. And it's, it was always co-linked. I was about to say, because it never came out against me. I didn't even know yeah, you were running it. Yeah, it's it's nice. Like, scapegoat, if Scapegoat didn't get negated, it, it came out. But it was always, it gotcha. was exactly what I wanted. Um, Trouble Burst is okay. I, I don't have a lot to say about it. Um, 2400 is nice. Pierce is nice. Um, the other effects are obviously nice. But um, it's the kind of thing where, like, I'd almost always rather have Unicorn instead. Mm. Um, which, again, is basically a staple. Yeah. So... Uh, then the, the two ones that really come up a lot, um, Boral Sword, um, the Boral Sword, the Boral Sword Ooh. Toad play is amazing, it's almost always OTK, um, if, unless you get thrown out really easily, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but it's really good, I, I, I just can't imagine not having that in the deck, and then similarly Avermax, um, God card. this card, like, I had a couple games today where people were like, what does that card do, oh crap, I can't out Avermax, and that was just game, like, yeah. there's a lot, there's a lot you can't play whenever you have Avermax in the field. Um, and then this is kind of like the goofy, cheesy card. Ooh. Um, oh, Falcon. God. So, All right, um, pause. Let me tell you something, okay? So, oh, round oh, one, he I hit Waking the Dragon, and... Yeah. Um, <laughs> this card... This card just says, um, sorry. I mean, there's not a lot you can do. It uh, can't be, can't be uh, targeted, which is amazing. Um, not affected at all. 3,500 can't really be attacked over by most things. It's it's kind of gross. Um, so for side, um, through Nibiru, it never really came up today either. Um, but Nibiru is Nibiru. People play it for a reason. It's a good yeah. card. Uh, I'm not going to take it out. Uh, effect failure. Really? Also, I didn't see this. Um, there were a couple times where I, th like... I, I sat it in, but it didn't come up. Um, I like it. It's decent. I think it'll probably leave side. I just don't think... It, it's good, but I think there's other things that I'd rather have. So, um, And then there's Inspector Border. People have rave reviews about this card. Don't get me wrong. I think it's good, but like... Every, every deck profile I've seen that plays this in Paleozoics, they're like, oh, this is the best card in the deck. If I side this in, it's a game. I've, I, I just don't feel that way. It's okay. Um, it's, it's a good card to have. I still like it. I don't know. 
Um, I, I don't think it's like the god card people play it out to be. If you can't <laughs> get it, I don't think it's a big deal, but it's nice sometimes. Um, then there's Get Out. Uh, Ooh, three. Yeah, three. I, I don't know how much I like yeah. that either. Uh, really? You don't <laughs> like honest. Get Out? I like Get Out. The problem is that it's a hard two, um, which can sometimes be a little hard to play with. Um, you don't target up two, you target two, which kind of sucks. Um, well, I guess with the Orcus board, in board right yes. now is... Anything, like, a lot of the meta, like, this is great. This is phenomenal. And especially once Master Rule 5 hits, I think this is going to be even better. Oh, yeah. Um, it's going to be Cumbles on crack. Ex yeah, seriously. So I do like it for that reason. Um, but right now, the kind of decks that I played against today, I, I don't know. It's okay. It's okay. I, I, I think I'd like it more like that original than, like, here. Um, and then Waking the Dragon, which is... Probably my favorite card in the deck. Uh, <laughs> this, this, card, this card is just stupid. Um, it, re it really is. Um, you side this in game two whenever they also side in all of their background destruction. destruction stuff. And then you say, oh, I'm sorry. Um, I guess 3,500 to your face. Uh, it's, it's really cheesy. Um, and I, I do like it a lot. I don't know if I like it at three. I might take it down to two because there were a couple times where um, I drew two and neither yes. of them get popped. Yeah. Um, so it's nice in the situation when it does get popped, but like it's it's kind of risky. You're not guaranteed. So, but yeah, that's, that's what I got. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem.